I am Carla Colon, your Puerto Rican host. And I'm Waverly Witkowski, your American host. Yeah. Grab your tea, grab your coffee, and if you're vegan, grab your water, because I don't discriminate. Welcome back to Chit Chats. What are you eating? Wrong, okay, first of all, wrong show. Second of all, what is that? Is that Taco, Taco Bell? Bell? I love Taco Bell. No. Yes. Because you know what? Today's topic of the show is tacos. That is true. No? Yes. That is true. Okay. <laughs> and today we are going to be basically visiting local uh, taco shops that you can only find here in Lakeland, Florida. Mm -hmm. And then we will let you guys decide what you think. Yes, so we're gonna be talking about what we loved, what we didn't really like, what we probably hated, and we're gonna rate them at the end. Yeah, so stick around, and we're gonna be visiting three very special places here in Lakeland, Florida. We'll be right back. Okay, let's go. And leave your Taco Bell. Cherry! Welcome to La Mich, aka La Michoacana. This is our first uh, location, so we're gonna be tasting tacos and reviewing our experience. We're gonna have um, carne asada y al pastor tacos. All right, I hope they like them because I love them. Let's go check it out. So first thing first, for the tacos that we got at La Manchuacana, we had, well, yours was a little bit different. I had uh, two asadas and then one chicken when I was supposed to have two asadas and then al pastor. Something like that. Right? Yeah, so All me right. and you got the same thing. Um, they asada and pastor, mm -hmm. so which right. is, Season pork and beef. Yeah. So I honestly, I love the minch. La minch. Um, they're dollar tacos, and they're probably like the best tacos you'll ever have. I mean, we'll get to talk to the rest of them, but like, they're really, really, really good. Um, so it's a great price. They're open every day of the week from 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. Okay. Um, so very Mexican. You truly feel like you're having the Mexican food experience because. Mm -hmm. I mean, we had tacos, but they have other things in the menu. Yes, they have like nachos, rice and beans, different like meats on the side. Okay, let's talk about the building. Oh, okay. <laughs> or oh, the yeah, lack the thereof. <laughs> okay, the go ahead. There is no building. No. <laughs> and there are no, no walls. walls. No, literally. There's a gate. No walls. Almost something, we call it a kiosquito. So a kiosquito is basically like a little, a little tiny house where you can buy food and then you sit but it's like outside sitting. So on a scale from one being like, this is the worst experience I've ever had, and five being like, oh my God, this is amazing. I'm definitely gonna come back, and I'm gonna recommend it to someone else. For La Michoacana, what would you rate it? Five. Five for Same. sure. Same. It was so good, and it's a dollar for a taco. Like, How bad? It's and it's like a double, yeah. the double tortilla tacos. It's not like a one tortilla taco. It's, you get two, it's so just, if the meat the, fall out. It has so much boom. meat. Um, also, and that's like j just like the regular taco. They have their American tacos, which are 150, and those have um, lettuce and sour cream and avocado Everything if you, you want. Used. But their regular tacos, their authentic Mexican authentic. tacos, it's just cilantro and cebolla. Oh, uh, onion. Yes. All right. So you get it. You get let's it. go ahead, Waverly. What was our second location? So our next location is Taco Bus, and what better way to order than in an actual bus? Yes. So let's go eat. Round yeah. It's a lot more Americanized version of tacos, so it wasn't as authentic to me. Um, more like what you would find in normal tacos that Americans would have, lettuce, um, tomatoes. Taco tomato, Buzz is where I meat. would take my white friends that don't necessarily like experiencing with like a lot of spices. Because okay. I have white friends that are like, I, don't I really love Taco Buzz. I love, yeah, and like they're like, oh, I love Mexican food, but they don't really like spicy, they don't really mm. like seasoned. So there's that. That and I feel like because we went from a super authentic to like a more Americanized, I could definitely tell the, the difference. difference. And it like it was almost like a shock. Like it almost like shocked my taste buds. Yeah. Our tacos were a little bit different. So for my taco, I got like we all got one taco because the the price here was a lot more expensive. Well, Three dollars. Three dollars. It was $3. bigger. It was a lot bigger. It, so I got a beef, like a regular beef taco, and then the guy asked, "Do you want sour cream and cabbage?" And I had never been to taco. 
Taco Bell, so I thought like- I was like, cabbage? I thought that was like typical, you know? No. So I was like, of course, sour cream and cabbage. And then I realized <laughs> no. that's not regular. No, it's not a thing. Not a thing. I did not order the cabbage. Neither did I. Um, I messed up. <laughs> I think, think it was great customer service. Mm -hmm. I think Fair. they treated us very well. It was clean. Oh, yeah. um, it was in a very pretty area. It's in downtown Lakeland, right next to Palace Pizza. Mm -hmm. They have a very spacious area to eat, too. So it'd be cool. Of... Although you can take your friends to the Mitch, it's just. But this one is like more inside, a little bit cozier. Oh, and they do have. Um, they do have more variety in their menu because mm -hmm. it's a little bit Americanized. They had dessert, they oh, had dessert. They had we had their desserts. churros, oh, which, which were really, really good. good. Mm -hmm. um, it's just not as authentic. Yeah. The guys had like the sombreros, so that was like really cool that yeah. he offered us to like wear them. <laughs> yeah. 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 So, one through five. Okay, right. in three, two, one. Oh, we all like <laughs> oh, yeah, again. Because it wasn't like it wasn't super bad. It was just no, a noticeable not. difference for me in the way yeah. like it tasted. But the experience That's is great. Very the nice. Mitch is winning though. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then next. And for our third location, we had Tacos El Torito. I've actually never been here before, so we're very excited. We've noticed a few different things. This is the first um, hole in the wall taco place. That's like a bus type situation that has combos. And we'll be talking about that on our panel. So we'll see how it goes. It's literally like a bus. And yeah. it's really, no really sitting small. area. Mm -mm. There's no tables, no chairs. You were looking so it's for literally a like drive up, get your, your food, taco and, and leave. leave. Literally. Leave. Not even that a parking cheap. spot for them. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. Like we went, we got our tacos and we were like, oh. Let's go to the Taco Bell parking lot. <laughs> yeah. This is like the taco truck and then Taco Bell right next to it, which is a little weird, but yeah. American taco. What, <laughs> I, no tacos. what I would say though, they had great pricing. Oh, so we sure. got yes. we got six tacos for five dollars and drink. sketchy water. Yeah. It was, it was it was horchata. I don't think I don't so, because it looked like water and milk. Like so it was agua fresca. Yeah. Is that what agua fresca is? Yeah. Fresca means fresh. That wasn't fresh. <laughs> well, well, Eli really did like it. You see, <laughs> it really depends on who you. Sorry, it really depends on who you are, and if I don't know. Yeah. I would say that Taco El Torito is like the authentic American. Literally, <laughs> because yeah. it it was more authentic than Taco Bus. For sure. But it wasn't as seasoned as the Mitch. Mm -hmm. Yes, I agree. I agree. We should have gone to the Mitch last. It yeah. said our standards very high. It said the standards really, really high. high. <laughs> really yeah. hard too. Okay, All right. I think I'm ready. All right. All right. Three, two, one. I don't know what way this is, but this is a 3.5. <laughs> okay. Three and okay. a half. I am a three. Five. I am a season. Because I don't think, think it was on the level of three as a taco bus, but it definitely wasn't high enough to be a la meat. Yeah. So if I could put it in the middle, and it wasn't a four. Yeah. That's why I kept it at three. I think I don't know what the story five. is. You want the Mitch. Yeah. La Michoacana, actually, we did our research and we were looking at like the best taco places in Lakeland. And La Michoacana was number one. Number one. Yeah. And it's a dollar taco. Yeah. This has been great. Stick around. We'll be having another episode coming soon. And um, if you do visit these places, leave in the comments below. Like, tell us literally what you like. Yes. Mm -hmm. And honestly, some of our least favorite places might be your like Victor. top choice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. Let That's us know what you think. think. And let us tell us what you like. Yeah. Adios. Amigos. Bye.